Okay, so in this video, I want to show you how to add titles to your videos in Filmora X. So let's get straight into it. In this video, I'm mainly going to be talking about titles added from inside of Filmora. If you want to add in overlays of things like a lower third that you made in Keynote, for example, there's a video up here showing you how to do that. Then that'll be in the adding overlays video, which links up here. So let's go into Filmora. I just got a very quick segment from a video where I'm kind of just introducing myself. So at this point, I'm saying, Hi. I'm Owen Salisbury, a video editor from the UK. So when I'm basically saying, hi, I'm Owen Salisbury, I want to add a title that comes up and says Owen Salisbury. So for this, we want more of a lower third. So let's look in the new concept lower thirds. I'm thinking if these are more new ones, then I kind of want to look in here. So let's go into lower thirds. And actually, I'm going to drag this over a bit so I can see a few more at a time. And let's just see what this is like. So I'm just going to look for one, really. Let's look at this. That's more of a quote one. Yep, let's say I like that. So now I'm just gonna drag this into my timeline, just over my clip. I'm gonna double click on it. Now it's gonna give me some more options of basically what I can do. So I'm gonna change your text here to my name. And I'm gonna change the font to one that I use quite often. So there we go, we've got it in all capitals. And this is just kind of how I want it to be. I don't like the position of it necessarily, so I'm gonna bring this back so that this fills my screen a bit more. And let's just drag this over. I'm gonna nudge it up because it's knocked it off center. I'm not necessarily gonna play around with the scale of it as much because this is just really touching the text. You can also change the size of it all in general. So maybe I want it to be a little bit smaller. So we can go into scale, bring this down, bring it down in the position as well, just like you would in any other video. And if you don't know how to do this, then I've got a video on it up here. So now we can come back to our text. We can also play around with the animation. So maybe we want something like the cinema style. So when I come into here to play it, it does, I guess, more of a cinema style. Uh, personally, I'm not really a fan of that, so I'm going to have no animation because it kind of has that animation in with it. And I've just changed the clip a bit. Hi, I'm Owen Salisbury, a video editor from the UK, and you just so happened to stumble across my There we go, that's kind of, that's the lower third. You can also add in maybe a bigger title, so you can have your openers, titles, things like that. Let's look in the new concept ones. And we can double click on them to watch them. Yeah, let's say I like this one. This one I think I would use more as a lower third. Let's go into openers, and these are more your kind of big ones. Let's go with this one. Drag it on, and now let's double click on it to edit it. Change this, I'm just gonna put my name again, and change the font. There we go, that's the kind of font we want with it. You can do the same animation things. And yeah, so that's really them kind of titles. You can also just kind of make your own one by, let's say we just drop this one in, and then go into advanced. You can add more text, shapes, images, that kind of thing. And you've got this little timeline, which again, you can really just bring this out and have a play around with it. For me, I'm selected on text, so I've got all of my text things. There's some preset stuff. Uh, personally, I think I would use this more if I was just trying to get an idea of what I wanted to have. So let's say I liked this kind of one, but I wasn't a fan of the color. I can go in here. This is a gradient fill, so you can see that this is white and this is this blue. So maybe we want that to be blue to pink. You can change that in there. I wouldn't really use this that much, but this is some of the stuff you can do. You can add a border and then a shadow, uh, change what kind of shadow, that kind of thing. And then when you're done with it, you can click save as custom, save it as what you want, and then click okay. And now we've got in our custom one, we've got this here. Personally, I'm not really a fan of this and I would much prefer to make it more in something like keynote or motion or something and then bring it in, which I'll make a video on and it'll be up here. If you want to learn how to make a lower third like this in keynote, then there's a link up here to do that. And if you want to learn how to make a subscribe animation in keynote, there's also a link up here. I'll add links in the description to these videos and also the video on how to bring in an external title into Filmora. So thank you for watching this. If you enjoyed this, please give it a like. And if you want to see more content like this from me, then consider subscribing. So thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.